says border wall construction company and the quote from Donald Trump that the wall just got 10 feet tall. Liberty High School senior Addison Barnes wore this t-shirt to his people and politics class last January. He knew they'd be discussing immigration that day. Well, the t-shirt was just a representation of my political beliefs. Some who noticed the pro-border wall shirt. This school is very like Latino populated. Took offense to it. I offended a lot of people. Actually, I remember hearing about it like in the halls, you know, kids would come up to me and ask me if I seen it. Word of the shirt reached an assistant principal who pulled Addison out of class. She gave me the option to either uh, cover the shirt off or uh, get sent home. At first, Addison covered his shirt with a jacket. I thought to myself, you know, this isn't this isn't right. This is my First Amendment right to be able to wear the shirt. So I took off the jacket and the assistant principal had seen that and she sent for a security guard to escort me out of class. Addison went home and the school treated his absence as a suspension for defiance. Last week, Addison filed a lawsuit against Liberty High School. The high school, ironically named Liberty High School, had violated his free speech rights. Addison's attorney says even the school's dress code, which bars clothing with disruptive phrases, is not grounds for what happened. He was told he offended him, but that's that's a far cry from being disruptive, and it's certainly a far cry from violating school policy, let alone what is clear First Amendment free speech law. In a statement to KGW, a district spokesperson wrote, We are still reviewing this lawsuit and respectfully decline the opportunity to comment at this time. For now, Addison holds on to his views and the right to have and wear them. It's my political belief, plain and simple.